Hello uh, people of the universe, this is Avian Wizard and welcome back to another video and today in this video we are once again playing Minecraft Communities as we so often are on a Saturday at 7 o'clock and today we are going to be finishing uh, what we started in the last video being the uh, arcade thing um, so in between video I've essentially just done some uh, like finishing aspects to the outside um, I haven't done the roof because that's what we're going to be doing today uh, but first, uh, we're going to be, um, doing the thingy McBob, um, the inside, because that's where all the arcade machines are. So, yeah, let me go and, uh, feed all my dogs very, very quickly. And I've realised, I got into a habit when I had those robot dogs, of just not taking them with me, because I couldn't take them with me, and now I still don't take them with me. So, I mean, like... They just sort of stay here all day, which isn't necessarily a bad life. They just sit down all day and occasionally I come and feed them all. But yeah, uh, yeah, that's just an observation I have made. Um, so yeah, let's quickly go and run up to where we are building today. Um, and I haven't updated the map yet, but that's always fun. Uh, because I updated the map in between videos, so the ice skating place is there. Uh, and yeah, I think that... Like, it's not that great in person, but I think it looks quite nice overall. And I like the way that it all sort of, like, goes around the mountain. And soon, obviously, all that place will be filled in and stuff. So, yeah, it's starting to look like a proper place now. Which I think is a really, really cool thing. Um, and then in the next video, I've already planned out what we're building in the next video. Already way ahead. Uh, we're going to be building next to the uh, pink place. And I can't remember what that sells or what it's called. Because I think that's one of the things along with the Disco Oreo, or the Not-So-Disco Oreo, or the Normal Oreo, I think I called it. Um, Chock Horror, that's the one. Um, yeah, like, I didn't actually uh, name it. Uh, no, I didn't actually finish it. I did name it, I just named it. Um, but yeah, so, uh, however, I have been finishing all of these ones, so, yeah, that is perfect. So, let's get straight into it then. Um... So first off, I think what might be a good thing to do is to build the claw machine in the uh, right to back corner this is going to be. Uh, so we need some red concrete uh, and so it needs to be, uh, hang on, how, okay, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. So it's essentially just got to be a two by two hole in the middle and then it's going to be the same up here. Uh, and then this is going to link up to... Uh, there's actually going to be a sticky piston in this block here, or in the middle somewhere. I haven't, like, got an exact block that it needs to be on. Because if I go and grab this sticky piston, and I go and grab some blue concrete, and I'll go and grab the button while I'm here, uh, because I need the button. Um, if I go through here, and I go and put that there, and then I'll fill in these and then I just need to quickly go and grab some blue concrete powder and just fill in the middle two by two so four blocks in total and you just fill in the final block there there will be some glass around here I'm just gonna add that in a minute um, but if I uh, put a button there and you can see it's like an actual claw machine because it picks up the prize and then it drops it straight back so yeah uh, that's just that's essentially the main gimmick of the inside um, being that claw machine but I found it quite funny, so I decided to do it. And then because it's got blue on the bottom and red on the top, I thought um, purple stained glass could look quite nice. Uh, just going all the way around it. And I'll do the other side, even though you can see it, actually. I thought you might not be able to see it, but you can. So it's good that I decided to do the other side as well. Um, but yeah, so that's one thing built already. <laughs> We're like uh, five minutes into the video and I've already built something. Which is better than most videos, I'll tell you that much. Um... So what do we want now? We want some uh, orange wool. I'm, not, I'm going to build the pinball machines. And in Minecraft, I don't know whether you know this, but you can't exactly build working pinball machines, very sadly. So I'm just going to do an equivalent to that. So it looks like a pinball machine, but it's actually not a pinball machine because you can't make pinball machines. Uh, so they're very basic, just like that. Uh, but we are going to add a bunch of paintings to it. Uh, which is why I have so many paintings in here and a few rails. Uh, just so, yeah, just to add a little bit of decoration to it. Um, 
so essentially like if i go and grab a button i don't have another button on me oh no i forgot to bring more buttons okay i think what i'll do is i'm going to chop down a tree i have a habit of chopping down trees midway through video actually i don't think i have to i think we've got loads of wooden here yeah i do uh i only need one piece to make a button so we just grab that and then the rest of that's going to be for the roof later the roof isn't too fancy or anything like it looks fancy compared to most of the things around here but not compared to the rest of it and this is still lit up the shield is still lit up even though i can't make it um so yeah what is it that i wanted to do i wanted to craft a button that's the one um so yeah let me go and craft a spruce but oh, i need two buttons don't i um let me just go and grab another one and go to mechanisms again and there we go so um here if you place these here so normally there'd be two and there'd be like the paddles the flippers i don't know um but then if you just place one and you press it then it lights up both lights so that just looks pretty fancy and it also lights up the uh rail on top which looks quite nice um i'm not sure what type of rail is that an activator an activator rail uh that's a tiny bit odd because wait hang on what does an activator rail do i know these like when a thing's on top of it it makes a redstone signal but i don't know what activator rails do um so yeah we're just gonna make it so all the paintings along here are the same and it doesn't really matter what painting it is um but like they oh very lucky it's gonna be the same no nah, got three in a row perfect but now this one's gonna take ages i bet and i'm gonna accidentally destroy it when i get it which is always the case with paintings but there we go we've got it now and then um it's essentially like how pinball machines they never have like just they're never just a pinball machine they're always like scooby-doo pinball or doctor who pinball or whatever so uh like that's sort of my equivalent there these are um like whatever this is supposed to be pinball um a white thing with a black thing on top with a gray thing and some gray and blue things on the left but uh yeah like you know what i mean and that's the same one as over there i need it to be different um no that one looks too much like a painting actually okay whatever the next one's going to be i'm going to nope <laughs> whatever the next one that isn't those is going to be i'm going to use it okay let's use that oh nope didn't mean to do that um so i think here i'm just going to have to temporarily place down some dirt um just here Oop. there we go I just then it doesn't go and expand across and I think that painting that I've put down is ridiculously rare so I may have made a poor decision um yeah I don't seem to be getting it oh I just got it I just got it and again and I just destroyed it um okay I need okay literally any that's not okay let's just go with that one and then I'll place this one um is so it's the yellowy one uh that's not yellowy neither is this that's how we're gonna get there we go uh actually i'll do these two first uh yellowy one come on come out come out wherever you are uh that is not the yellowy one yellowy one come on I need you. I think they do all have names, but I'm not entirely sure what they are. I'll actually look that up in a minute. There we go. That's that one. Nearly just pressed the right trigger and destroyed it again. Um, there we go. The only trouble is with this is, like, I think at some point these paintings might start lagging the world. And there we go. That worked. Um, but, yeah. So, I'm going to have to be careful for that. But I think it should be fine for now. Um, so, if I keep trying to find these paintings... Uh, I don't know what that's supposed to be either a lot of these paintings i don't know oh nope uh oh no okay there we go uh there we go okay perfect and now i need one more here uh actually you know what that could actually look quite nice having a different one at the front i think i will do that actually yeah okay there we go that works 
Um, so, yeah, this is pretty much the two pinball machines finished. Um, so now, I'm going to run outside, go and grab um, some thing, uh, some more stuff to build out of. And I just fall straight back in. And, um, yeah, we're going to go and make some arcade machines. So we're going to have two, uh, well, we're going to have four. We're going to have two red and two orange. Um, so the way we're going to do this is, and oh, I don't think I have any string on me. Um, I've got to get the string. Okay. Uh, that's annoying, but I think I might have some string in my house, so I should be fine. Uh, but now I need to go make some carpets. Uh, where are the carpets? I assume they'll be in decorations. Yep, here we go. Um, so I only need two of each, so, uh, three is more than enough. Uh, there we go. Then let me go and grab this red carpet. And... Oh, no, I need the string for this, don't I? So I'm just going to add some paintings down for now. Oh, nope. Uh, I'll place down some dirt. Just, whoop, not there. Uh, here, 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 and here. Uh, there we go. Perfect. Um, and now, I need to go and break away all this. I might as well use a shovel. That's why I have a shovel, to break away dirt. Um, and, yeah, I'm gonna... Actually, I'll add the levers first. And then all we need to go and do is add the, um, string and the... Um, thingy. So these are like joysticks they're supposed to be. They don't look particularly like joysticks, but they're as close as you can get really in Minecraft. Um, so yeah, let me go and run back home. Uh, I think I have a, uh, storage room in my house. Yeah, I do definitely have a storage room. And I think I have a mob loot chest, but I tend to always use that mob loot chest. So I'm not sure whether there'll be any mob loot in there. Um... So most of the time I kill a mob and I just drop the loot straight away, which is probably a bad thing to do. Because then you get occasions like this where I'm after a specific thing and there's no spiders about because it's in the middle of the, uh, in the, middle of the day. Um, where is the sun, actually? I can't actually see the sun. Oh, there we go. <laughs> got really confused then. Um, so, yeah, let me go and run over here and just go into my house. And I need to have something to eat in a minute. I'm literally holding pumpkin pie. Uh, so there's no taxing issue there. Um, so yeah, let me go and run through here. And it's just on this floor through these doors and across this corridor. Um, so yeah, there's, there's loads of paintings in here as well. Uh, I really like these. <laughs> I just really like that room. It's just quite a nice room. It's got no real purpose other than to be a place where you go through. Um, to get to the rooms that you need and yes, I do have string. Okay. I don't need six I only need four But actually yeah, we'll keep two in there just in case I need some in the future Because you never know when strings gonna come in handy um, So yeah, let's just go and quickly run back uh, This this house is actually I think it's a really nice house, but like it's really annoying to have to try and run through it all because it's big like with, like, uh, you look at even, like, Mr. Pando's house, which isn't as big, but it's still a pretty big house. Like, you can literally just run downstairs and out the door. This one, you have to go through several corridors and then out the door and then downstairs and out the door. So, yeah, it is a little bit annoying, but I think it is actually quite nice. I also, like, when I built it, I was really happy with it, but I don't really like it anymore. Because, like, everything else in the world is, like, my design, but that's just a blatant ripoff of Iron Man's house. Because I thought that would be cool to live in an Iron Man house. But, like, I don't know, it's become my house now. Like, I can't change that. So, yeah. I think, I'm, like, I've had it for over a year now. So, I'm not gonna, like, try and change it around or do anything fancy to it. I'm, I mean, I'm still adding new rooms. Like, I haven't finished building it yet. But I've finished building it in video. Uh, like, the other week, I added that music room in Laurie's old room. So a lot of rooms, um, but I've got some more plans for stuff that I can add in my house. Um, it's just to make it look a little bit nicer. Uh, I want to redecorate the kitchen area a little bit as well, just because like it's pretty bad. Like I built it a while ago and the fancy furnace doesn't really work properly anymore. 
uh, just because it's really like laggy and like the game just doesn't like it. Um, so just need uh, oh, nope, not like that. Uh, need no, I just did the opposite of what I didn't want to do. Um, there we go. So yeah, I think now the only thing left to do is to do the roof. Actually, I might have some torches in here. I uh, just quickly so then uh, no mobs spawn while I'm doing the roof. Um, but yeah, so let me go and grab some dirt. I just put away my torches by accident. So I'll go and grab a bunch of this. Uh, I think I only need really. Uh, actually, I do need some stairs. Uh, I need some more stairs than that, actually. Um, so, is it going to be up or down? I think it's down, but I've gone further up now. So, I'm not going to go all the way back down. I might just, like, just cycle around. There we go. Um, and let's just pile up here. I've just made a little staircase for myself to get up. Um, so, I need to grab the spruce wood stairs. And then go, like, whoop, nope. Don't want to do that. Can I not place... Oh, no. What am I doing? I don't want to do that. Um, Alright, okay. I think what's going to be easiest to do is to fill in the entire thing with spruce wood planks first and then add the stairs in because otherwise this is going to be impossible to do. Um, so, yeah. Uh, let's just, I think if we go along like this and then just fill in the entire thing, because it's going to have like just one roof. It's not going to be like, I'm not doubling up the roof as well as the uh, walls, because you can barely see the roof anyway, because it's so dark inside. Uh, yeah, so I think I'm uh, just going to go along like this and then I'll just place the thing, the stairs along and then it's going to all hopefully meet in the middle and it's going to form like a cross shape. It should be quite cool. Um, it's, I, like, I tried to design a fancy roof, but like, it's really hard to do fancy roofs in Minecraft. Like, you just have a roof early, don't you? Like, you don't look at the roof too much. But it's nice to have different roofs. Like, Wizard Industries is probably my least favorite roof in the entire thing. Then you've got stuff like that, which is, I'm quite happy with the roof on. Um, stuff like that, the roof is designed to be bad. Like, that's, I think that's quite a nice roof. Uh, this doesn't have a roof. Well, I guess it does, and I I think if we're counting the design of the guitar as a roof, then that's got to be my favourite roof in the community world. Uh, but yeah, like, it's always nice to have a fancy roof just to finish the build. It's like, if you, like, it's like it ties it all together just to finish it. So yeah, I think that should actually be pretty good. Um, so I'm going to quickly go and carry on with this. And there's like, I don't know whether that'll be enough torches inside. Uh, because I can't remember where I added the torches or how many torches I added on the inside of my sketch record. Um, so yeah, it's going to be interesting to see how dark it is in there. I don't want it to be too light in there. Then I want it to be light enough where mobs don't spawn because I don't want to just walk in there and then a creeper shows up and it's like, ah. Um, but yeah, so... Let me go along like this, and I think it's here, it needs to turn, yep, there we go, and it all meets up, and then I just need to do the same on the other three, well these aren't really sides, the directions I guess, going out from the middle, um, just like so, and run out of stairs, of course I have, need to go and make some more, just make another crafting table and put, place it down up here rather than having to go all the way downstairs. Um, and yeah, well not, not as stairs because I haven't got any stairs, but like down off the roof, I guess. And oop, nope, I don't want it to go like that, I want it to go like, no, not like that. Um, if I go, oh no, if I then destroy this one, and then place this back, no! Place this down there. Okay, this isn't working. Hmm. No, that's not how you're supposed to go. There we go. Sorted. Oh, wait, hang on. Okay, yeah, it is sorted. That was just a bit of a shadow from the crafting table. But yeah, so this is pretty much the roof of this place done. 
Um, and I think uh, once I destroy this dirt, and I'll go and um, uh, quickly do the thingy McBob. Um, add a door down, that's the one. Um, where's the wood? There we go. And two down, yep. And then I made three doors. I only need two, but hey. Um, so yeah, this is the place pretty much complete. The arcade pretty much complete. I can't really see anything else to do to it except maybe link up the paths, which I'll do in between video. I'm not going to bother doing it right now. Uh, but yeah, so we've got two not working pinball machines. We've got two not uh, four not working uh, arcade machines. Uh, like games cabinets, I don't know. Um, and then we've got obviously the fully functioning claw machine that you can never win. Um, so yeah, uh, this has actually been probably one of my favourite builds in the community in recent memory. Uh, because that one over there, the ice skating rink is a load of rubbish. This one's pretty bad because like, I mean just look at it. I mean it's supposed to be a metaphor on life because that's what people make metaphors about. <laughs> Um, so yeah, I really like, I think that is my favourite build in a while. And so yeah, I thank you for watching, the next video will be online next week as always, with the link being in the description once it is. Um, so yeah, goodbye.